Hello, hello everyone! Hello. hello, hello! Today is a very special day. Alright, we, we usually listen to the music, we just listen to it, you know? We don't really, really get to, we really have our own interpretation of, course. of what, we, what we think the artist has done, and we don't really know, we've never really got to speak to the artist. Now, we have, uh, we have been, that's good, that smells good. You, uh, you put a little thing in there, too. Too hot, though. Too hot. So but yeah, we've listened to Giuseppe Verde. He is a, a recording artist, mm. uh, and his music is great. But the catch with this is that he is here. He's here. He's here. The art. So, <laughs> so, the way we present to you. The what? The only. only. The artist of the decade. Made Giuseppe Verdi! Alright. Come on in. Giuseppe Verdi! Hello, everybody! Hello, hello! Hey. Hello! It's great, it's, it's great to be here with you. Good to see you. I've seen you all. Come on in, come on in, come on in. Come on in. Yes! We got a tea. We got tea oh, for you. Oh, oh my lord, thank you. Yeah. Yes, oh, no. yes, you want to do no a little problem. cheers yeah. together yeah. a little bit? Oh, yeah, oh. yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Of course. Oh, uh, careful. It's kind of hot. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What, are you, what, are you, what are you drinking? Ah, I think I burned my tongue. I don't know what I'm drinking. What am I drinking? Irish breakfast tea. Irish breakfast Irish tea. Irish breakfast tea. That's Irish breakfast good. tea. That is good. How's it? How, how are you, Brenda? Are you on tour? What are you doing right now? Oh, uh, well, you Happy? know, I'm working on uh, something. A little something, something. A little something, something. Seems to be determined. You know, whenever I'm working on something, you know, what kind of. Um, and the original plan is always going to be an EP, but the next thing you know, it's just a single. Ah. You know, yeah. of course. Of like, course. Mark of the Wild was going to be an EP yeah. called The Wild, and it was oh. going to be all of this kind of, you know. Wilderness. Well, yeah, yeah, but, but, you know, just the Mark of the Wild. Ah, I, I thought it was just going to be a one hit wonder. Ah. Uh, you yeah. know? And yeah, to mark the momentous day of Mark of the Wild, you, you might even want to start talking about that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's come out today. Come out today. No, it didn't come out today. It came out uh, oh. two days ago. Oh, oh okay. well, we listened to it today. today. No, I understand. Yeah. We're late. We're late. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Um, <laughs> so let's discuss it. What, what inspired you? Well, here's the thing. You know, I just got back. I came back from... Ah, uh, the Himalayas for oh. this, for this, uh, oh, wow. wow. Yeah. All wow. the way from the Himalayas. This, this interview. Oh, now that, that makes, that makes us feel very cool. honored. Now, now, I was over in the Himalayas, I was down in Asia, I was over in the wilds of Alaska to gather the sound effects you hear. Oh, wow. The sound effects you, you hear. literally I did, I went, them. I got the thunder, I got the rain. Okay. Oh, I the people good. doing the shakers those were indigenous peoples from the northwest. Oh they were wow! Indigenous. And the whistler that was a professional whistler who tames fox Whoa, and eagles over in the Himalayan mountains. This is amazing. You guys, you're so this? you're so ambitious and yet so uh, you're not that flashy. Yeah, you know? I'm trying not to be flashy. Uh, very I mean, humble guy. You, you see very that, humble you see guy. That, you see these Modest. celebrities now. Yeah. You know, when I was at the when I was at the Grammys. Mm. The, sh the amount of money they put into the damn suits they wear. Uh, Where did I go in? Ah, Giuseppe's finest. And I was, well, this is all my flash right here. Well, the, was there it. you go. That's it. Boom. There you go. You don't need to Boom. show anything. That's what I call. That's what I call soul bling. That is there soul, we soul go. Bling. Because my music gets full of soul. Ah, and it's, it's 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 a reflection of who I am, and that's why I wasn't gonna put on a suit to mask who I am. Ah, I was gonna go beautiful. as me. And beautiful. That's and then, hey, that got rewarded because you were the artist of the of decade. The decade. Wow. wow. That now I see your sunglasses. They have um the British uh, flag yeah. pattern. Yeah. Well, when I debuted the Thrill, when I, when I released the Thrill, I was going on tour in England, mm -hmm. and uh, this female I was involved with mm -hmm. left her glasses in the room, mm -hmm. and I. Hello. <laughs> That's Hello. In an inside scoop. I love it when, you know, English women wear stuff from England. Oh. You know that says that it's from England. England. You know what I mean? 
So it's like when people in New York have a sweater that says New York. I love New York or something. You know? Then you know they must live in New York. New York. Yeah. Yeah. Just like with her. But you know. He must be British. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Exactly. Exactly. And people think I'm British. Ah. I'm like no no no. But Anyway, back you're to one. Yeah. You're one with the universe. Yeah. That's hey, you're all, all over the place. You were just even talking <laughs> indigenous. I was, you know. I was bringing my music to different parts of the world. Wow. Of course. You know, yeah. that aren't fortunate enough to hear the kind of music that is being made anymore. Wow. Mm. Mm. I'm taking, I'm keeping them away from Kanye, and I'm giving them my schmuck. Oh, 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 hey, whoa, taking shots Those at Kanye. Those dicks at Kanye, the, uh, the uh, man of the West? Wow. Oh, man. Wow. Wow, that's a big claim. That is a big claim. Now, I just want to go some more. <laughs> Kanye and I, when we were at the Grammys, there okay. was a bit of a tiff. Oh, uh, okay, all right. So How is his interview, he was in, what, uh, a week or two ago? He really hit me. He hit me hard. Like, physically? No. No, oh, no, okay. no, with his words! Right. With words. words! I'm sorry! With the words, with the with words. With words, yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, and, yeah. um, I, 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 you know, I, I just thought I'd take a cross. What did, what did he say? He jabbed, I crossed. What did he say? Of course. He was giving me goddamn shit. I had released... Episode. Okay. Episode. Yeah, episode. Episode. Of course. You know, we got we your got first EP. Yeah. Yes. 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 We've got uh, waiting on you. Mm -hmm. We had the dynamic duo, but I took it off. Oh. oh. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Uh, then we have uh, till you gone. Till you gone. Till you gone. gone. And we had who was my baby. And when he listened to uh, till you gone. He told, he said in the interview, he's like, Giuseppe Verdi does not know what it's like to be involved with a woman. He's just been by himself, playing with himself all his life. <laughs> and I'm, oh my I'm thinking to myself, bitch, where'd I get these glasses? Oh, hey. Hello. Why did you say that, though? Oh. Where did I get these glasses? Hello. <laughs> Where did he get the glasses? Where did he get them? If he was not Come with on. The Oh, my goodness. Well, since this is a new episode... That's classy. Yeah. That's classy. I like that. Since this is a new episode of Tune Talk, why don't we start with talking about the episode, if we're diving into the music. Of course, of course. Delving straight in. I might even just pull up the track list so we can well, just... Yeah, go for it. Go, go for down. it. So you guys just continue some banter, some little, little, little back and forth, play. <laughs> play, huh? <laughs> um, okay. Um, so, who is your manager? Oh, well, I got quite a few. Got mm. quite a few managers. My main one is Skylar Moore. Mm -hmm. Okay. We've got uh, Mary Flanagan, Vaughn Broadwick, Willa Main. Now, I'm going to say something right now. Whoa. Skylar Moore. Is the main man. The main man. The main He's man. the main man. Let me tell you, Mary Flanagan, yes, she helps me advertise and market. Willamaine and Vaughn Broderick, the only thing they do is tell me, get dynamic duo on your next EP. Uh, and I took it off because it's just an inside joke about the both of them. Yeah. So what the hell is anybody, how the hell is anybody else supposed to enjoy it? Yeah. It's still online, but it's not a part of episode. It's Okay. You gotta tell the women so Absolutely. Why. And you know what? To be honest, I have to be I have to be real with you. It kinda doesn't match the flow. The right? flow is the one that stuck out the most. Exactly, because an episode. And there I was, I was standing there, I was standing in uh I was getting acupuncture. Mm. You know, I like to go get my uh, chakras aligned. Oh, yeah, gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all and I was standing in the outside in the hallway in the bathroom. Yeah. And I'm waiting to go in the bathroom. And I heard somebody inside listening to the episode. Oh, wow. Ah. And I heard they played Waiting on You, Till You Gone. Dynamic Duo came on, two words in, they skipped it. Ooh. And then they listened to You Was My Baby. <laughs> and I was like, I've been oh debating taking it off. And I was like, you know what? Oh. Just. Because then he went through it again and he skipped it again. Jeez. Wow, wow this guy know. was not. I had no idea. idea. I was standing outside. You know what? I almost think that the dynamic yeah. duo would uh, fit better on the album. Yeah. The thrill. This is what was that interesting: thrill. is I actually had recorded it for the. I was telling him to lock the door. Oh right, right, right. Oh. Surprise! Sometimes we get intruders. Uh, and stuff. The 
Now, uh, yeah. what does that mean exactly? Uh, I believe it means to hell with it. Ah, piss on it! Yeah, piss. <laughs> piss on it! Yeah. Piss now, on now, it, now. guys! Don't tell anyway. that to R. Kelly. Hello! No, no, no. no. Yes. I recorded it. It was supposed to be on the thrill. It's first time. Thank you. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I, uh, and then I was, I recorded another song. Mm. And I didn't realize that I accidentally recorded it over the same file. And so I accidentally completely deleted you was, um, not you was my baby, Dynamic Duo. Oh. The file still had the name Dynamic Duo, so I'm uploading it, and I'm getting, you know, slow boat to China. Oh. And I'm sitting here going, well, you know what? Must be fake. The hell with it. I was even thinking about yeah. this. I was even thinking the about it. The hell with it. What the hell with, with it, the Dynamic. Well, not to them in person. No, 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 no. They're great. The song. They are. The song. They yeah, are. the song. Song, it's know. more of a song if they're in the room and I'm live. Oh, we'll do, do, we'll do the dynamic duo. And they know where to find it on SoundCloud. They know. They know where it is. Um, but yeah. So let's, let's, let's look hop the right in. I've got it. It's uh, it's about three tracks. Three Episodes, tracks. Three tracks, yeah. yes. And we'll start with even talking about Waiting <clears throat> on You. Waiting on You. That's very one of my, one of my favorite. Nice one. Or is it? One nice of my favorite. Very beautiful. I don't know. I think... I think I don't know, I have to listen to Mark of the Wild again, but that's yeah. another favorite. Yeah, this one, it just the chords are just so soothing. Thank you. There's a story to tell, even with the instrumental and the lyrics. See, I remember I... I, I uh, sorry. Oh, no, 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 I, 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 I was... I Whenever was that happens, just take a sip. Take a sip. Uh, uh, I will. Okay. <laughs> little <laughs> Irish breakfast. Dude. Little Irish breakfast. Little Irish. So, you know, I, I... There you go. There it is. I'm getting my foggy up here, getting my glasses foggy up here. Oh. Now, I was, I was messing around with the chord progression. Ah. And, uh, and it just came to me. And I was telling, I was telling, uh, Skylar Moore during a one-on-one -on -one interview about how I believe that the best place, the place where I get my, the most divine intervention is when I'm sitting on the porcelain throne. The porcelain ah. throne! And I think it has to do with... Yeah. You got the vents here, you got the the energy coming from above. Yeah. And you've got the what's beneath you, the energy yeah. coming from beneath. And it meets in the middle and it, 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 it manifests itself through the vibrations oh. of the guitar. And then the and shit it just came. comes out. Any oh bad yes, thing I, was, I wasn't going to say that. Oh, yeah. well. Let's be civil here. Sorry. Hey, no. Sorry. No, no, no. So, you know, I. I, uh, I, I, uh. Yeah, it came to me, and then I, I was like, I didn't know what I was gonna. I don't want to touch my teeth. Hey, no, uh, I didn't know what I was gonna do with the chord, uh, the, with the lyrics. Yeah. It's like, oh, it'll just be an instrumental, I'll call it anthem. Oh, okay, whatever, whatever. I was fucking around with it, it sounded like. Mm. So I was like, the hey, look, I'm going to forget it. The hey, look, forget it. it. So then, <clears throat> I'm sitting there talking to Skylar Moore, and we're talking about consciousness, different levels of consciousness, and uh, he's like, oh, well, you know what? If I die, man, don't worry, man. You'll, you'll, I'll just be waiting up there for you. Oh. And I thought to myself, I put my head to the pillow, and I was like, that's exactly what I'm going to do when I wrote the lyrics in 15 minutes. Wow. Incredible. That's so nice. <laughs> Did he ever know that he was the, uh, yeah, you know, you know, know. that's beautiful. There's actually a music video being, gonna be made yeah, that song, I've heard. Uh, with these two fellas right here. Uh, uh, yeah, they didn't even know. Now they know. You didn't know? No, they didn't know. Oh. Uh, well, um, maybe, could you tell us what the music is? Video I don't know. Yeah. All I know is that I'm gonna be having a friend of mine who's very close. I don't want to spoil. Okay, we won't spoil it. You will all see it soon. Of course. Yes. But beautiful. That's real beautiful stuff. Very good. Thank you. There is. Till you gone. Is that his last name? Silva. De Silva. De Silva. De Silva. De Silva. So you can call me whatever you want. The Silva Fish. <laughs> ah, <laughs> new nickname. The Filka Fish. The Silva Fish, huh? Yes. I like it. There we go. Thank you for that. Thank you. So, uh. <laughs> so, <laughs> waiting on you. I gotta say. Oh, God. It's a beautiful, beautiful song. Yes. Yeah. 
Um, but what I, what I really like, I have to re-listen to the episode because the last time I heard it, it had that dynamic duo, which ruins the flow a little bit. But, oh, wow. I'm just saying, hey, I'm just saying. No, I'm wow. just saying. I'm going so, to go. with you. Um, so, then, then I hear Till You Gone. Mm. Now that is some funky stuff. It is funky. Yeah. It's funky. But not like funky, like, dump a dump, but just like, <laughs> yeah. funky as in it's, it's got a, it's certainly got a tempo to it, right. you know? And you can bob your head with it. So what inspired that? Yeah. Well, I mean, not only was it a woman I met in, um, I think that was in Indonesia. Indonesia. Uh, Indonesia. Indonesia. And, uh. I won't go into personal information, oh, but then I was performing in Japan, same thing, another one. Really? Wow. Wasn't leaving me alone. Right. Wow. So, you know, I was going to just let it out the music. Of course. Uh, of course. Uh, of course. I'm going to smack you on the puss because it made my life a little bit more. Now, when you say puss, what does that mean? Yeah, face. let's, so people face. know. It's face. It's a Jewish term for face or a kind of a human being. Oh, yeah. So See. he's not, when he's saying puss, he's not talking yeah, about not, yeah. your puss. Yeah. Yeah. He's talking about your puss. He's talking about your face. Talking your about face, your face. Your body. Not your, uh, what have you. What have you. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah. So that that's interesting. That's very interesting. Um, yeah. Pretty modern lyrics going on. Yeah, because I'm about talking about tracking you. Yeah. Tracking me. That's what they did. Yeah. I moved out of. Oh shit! I can't remember the city I was in. Yeah. I was in Japan. Um, I moved out, and I was kind of in like near the mountain ranges, and I was actually, that's where I began doing some research for the Mark of the Wild. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Wow, so this is, the, that has been... So you were you on your way to handle it. Yeah, yeah, no, I was on the journey. I really was, and next thing you know, I, I looked on my phone, and you know, I still have service. I'm like, wow, I have service out here, and God, and, and you know, when God lost his shoes? Yeah. So yeah. I'm sitting here, and next thing you know, I open the door of my hut, and there is this woman. Oh. oh so I told her I called the cops and she didn't go away. There you go. That's what you gotta do. Uh, the Himalayan cops? Or? And she said, Don't you dare write a song about this! Oh. oh. Got her. That's right. She got, got her a thing or two. Nice. I mean, wow. Why well, I was right. Wow. wow. You're a singer songwriter. Of course you're gonna write a song about this. Come on. Come on. The intriguing stuff happens from life. Truth. You know? Truth. Uh, uh, um, I was watching something and it was about it was about animation. And they said animators, they're never about capturing realism. What they really want is believability. And I feel like a lot of the stuff I listen to you, it's not necessarily about realism because I mean waiting on you deals with you know, looking down upon some of the from heaven above and, and all these, you know, um, these concepts that are pretty you know, pretty big. But there's a believability to it. <clears throat> Screw the realism. Realism it's unnecessary yeah, it's unnecessary limitations, you know. And I just wanted to say I, res I respect the believability I get from this song. Voila! Look at me! Oh. Magic chains of clothes! Look at me! Nobody, oh, that is no, amazing! See, what people don't bring up with me in a lot of the interviews is I have a past of being a musician. I mean, a magician. Magician! Ah. Man, I did not know Don't worry about that. I, uh, you know, I used to uh, take rabbits out of hats and uh, steal people's money out of their ears, but I wouldn't tell them. Whoa! That was back in the day when I was a sly motherfucker, too. You know, was, that's before I released The Thrill. That was back when BB. You know, uh, 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 but yeah, TV. see, look at this. I mean, you didn't even notice, but I had red corduroys on and a white shirt with a hole in it. Wow! Uh, I black pants and a gray shirt. I, we didn't even notice. Oh, you like this quick change stuff. Yeah. Huh? Oh, I'm going to quick change. You know what? Hey, let me tell you something. Too long All right. You know what? I'm a master of distractions. OK? 
up to the moment. You look one way, hey. I'm gonna snatch your shoes, your pants, your belt, your wallet. You're gonna be butt naked before I'm through with you. Wow, that is amazing. Incredible. That is pretty amazing. I'm a Renaissance man, a magician. If only went to my middle school. Everybody would pants each other. Oh, oh I would steal those from the king of the pants. Hey, let me tell you, you know what? I'm surprised they haven't released, uh, you know, Magic, that song Magic? It's Magic! No! I should be, I should be. Oh, you people always have never ceased to inspire me. Oh, my goodness, <laughs> that is amazing. Yeah. 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 All right. So, so we were talking. Of, we were finishing off the episode, uh, the your 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 your, your EP. And you was <laughs> hey, hey the boat. You know, you was my baby. Was the last one we Right. Yes. The you was my baby. Let me tell you something. You was my baby. Yeah. Features D top. Yeah. It was a live recording session. So it was you know like, it was live. And it was gonna be one take, whatever happens, happens. And I remember I was wrestling around with a little blues riff, and uh, D-Top walks in the room, and next thing you know, he starts improv with me, and then next thing you know, I'm like, we're gonna do this. We're gonna and do next this. thing you know, we got you, what's my baby? Next thing you know, next thing you know. Next thing you know. Next thing you know. Keeps you on your toes. Keeps going. What do we really know? Hello. All you know is... Uh, I guess the next thing. Epistemology. <laughs> uh, Wait, what does that mean? The knowledge, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the study of knowing, knowledge of what do we really know? Oh, that is what, an what interesting do you study. Learn, epistemology. Do you learn yeah. through experience or do you learn through, you know, the schooling kind of memorize and regurgitate? Chalasna. Chalasna. The hell with it. The hell with it. The hell with it. The hell with that. And to hell with Still pretty hot. To hell with the baby. Well, no, not to hell with her. Um, Actually, to wherever she is. My manager had a baby recently. Oh, Skyler had a baby? Uh, yeah, my, her name's Naomi. She, she, oh. She's speaking already. How did it get where? Uh, Joseph did. Oh. Oh. oh, Joseph was the surrogate. Yeah, yeah. Oh, ah. Man, that's really great. Incredible. That's so amazing. Well, they're married. You know what happened anyway. Yeah. <laughs> This song was 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 a uh, was a good amount of passion in it, good amount of growling, jazzy sort of sound going on. D Top was a very uh, he's uh, a commanding brilliant. force. In he this, uh, he's got song. presence. That man has really got presence. Yeah. Oh yeah. That was. He that does. Was, you too. That's why I think it'd be a great idea if you guys uh, if you guys did a live version. Yeah. Of that song. Yeah, you know. Could you elaborate? Oh, well, because we we recently saw you live. Yeah. And at first, D-Top wasn't there. Then he showed up. Showed up and you, you, you did, you was my baby without D-Top. And it was okay. Yeah. It was okay. You know, we joined in a little bit. A little bit. And then D-Top showed up. You know, surprise, oh, surprise. I didn't know. You know, like the ending of just a, an, an epic movie. <laughs> of all proportions. Yes. He's my hero. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, he I don't blame you. Nowhere. And he showed up and he brought a whole new energy to that song. That was not captured in the tape that you have an episode. And I'm just wondering, wouldn't it be nice? Or not wondering. But I'm just thinking, wouldn't it be nice if, you know, you guys did a live version of that song? There you go. Well, you know, and then you're getting me thinking. Really? Yeah. What if I mean? You're, I mean, do you think that you know we could just get an album of Giuseppe live, like a performance, oh. Oh. like just set up the the booth and yes. just record a whole performance and get that vibe with the people wow. singing, and cheering, yeah. and the people him singing, it. and his side comments and his fuck ups. But that's what makes the performance better. That's Man. the live perfections, man. That's yes. the live. We could, I could that's what like, makes a performance See, here you go inspiring me again, you oh, oh, my man. gosh. Did you just say that's what makes a performance yeah. perfect? Is the imperfection. Yes. Beautiful. It's where the death is. beautiful. <laughs> Let me yeah. tell you something, Mr. Comerford and Mr. De Silva. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. No, 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 no performance. Got no lost in train of thought. No performance is the same. Yeah, man. No. And no. there's no such thing as a perfect performance. No. no. And if no. we're not striving for perfection here, okay, 
Yeah. Let's just do what we do. Do what we do. Do what we do. Lovely. There it is. Lovely. Yeah. That's that's that's, that's this goddamn tea I'm about to burn myself, LaFonda! Hey, 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 hey. What's you up? Well, come on, LaFonda with the tea. Now we're moving on to the thrill. The thrill, man. The, the thrill. thrill. The thrill the of thrilling it all. experience to the ears. That's right. That's yes. Right. Cool. The eyes live. The thrill. That was my debut album. Debut. 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 I had been performing in the Common Room Theater, and then I had moved uh. to the Skylar Moore Theater, uh. and I was getting a following. Mm. Wow. So I said, you know what? I'm going to release an album. There you go. Uh -huh. and, I, and I did. And you did. What I consider one of the best decisions you've ever made. Yeah. Oh, it got me to where I am today. That album. Oh, beautiful. Without, well, I mean, without you people, oh. it wouldn't even. Oh, you know, it showed up in my head to be. Oh, I should make an album. Yeah. 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 What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You know, I mean, you blow no. my mind because here you are being an, uh, a, a, a modest man, and here I am thinking this guy's way too much. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. There you yeah. go. All right. This is consisted of the eight tracks. We'll start with the first one. Thrill is gone. Thrill is gone. Oh, it's a cover. Thrill is gone. It is a cover. BB, right? BB King. BB King. King. King, you know, he. Uh, rest in soul. Yes. Yeah, rest in soul, rest, rest in, in peace, peace, you know. Wherever you are. Uh, but, you know, he. he, he but, see, before I was even involved with the CCC, the Candy, the candy, 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 candy King, uh, Broken Mike, I was involved with BB King. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that could be misinterpreted. I wasn't. I, I oh, like oh, that. oh! Hey, you know, but, you know, I you was know a how companion. The old days were. He was a mentor of mine. I guess he saw something in me, and he passed the thrill to me. And he says, oh. "Thrill is gone." And every time I sing that song, I'm thinking to myself, "The thrill ain't gone, brother. Your Still soul like is always gonna. Not your soul. Your legacy will always mm. be kept alive here. And that's our duty to keep these great artists' legacies." Alive, you know. Mm. I mean, look at William Shakespeare. Mm. Of course. I mean, his legacy is still here. Mm. Yeah, still here. And still it's still, still evolving. It's still, still. I mean, still my evolving. thrill is gone. Song cover is different than BB King's. Oh, absolutely. You know, it's different. Amen. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right. How many people try to just replicate, replicate, uh, replicate, replicate? What's so spontaneous and fresh about that? Hmm? Nothing. Uh, nothing. Nothing at Why all, Mr. Mayor. Hey, hey, hey no, man. No. Sometimes the way I think of it is, people they're craving something. But if you don't give them what they're craving, but give them what they didn't even know that they were craving. Yeah. And even yeah. innovation can be exactly. originality. The flavors yeah. they didn't yeah. even know they wanted. That's where the yard, that's where the money comes from. Yeah. I mean, you look at the marijuana, you know, you look at marijuana and how they're, you know, everyone's craving the marijuana, but mm. next thing you know, they're putting the fentanyl in there. Oh. That is, uh, I mean, it's a great way of explaining what you said, yeah. but in a not so not great so context. No, no, but uh, what, uh, <laughs> yeah. could you elaborate on this fent fent fentanyl? Fent uh, uh, the pandemic. What's going, what's going on with that? People are lacing marijuana uh, oh. with fentanyl. Now, what is oh. fentanyl? It's, it's, I believe it's more powerful than heroin. Oh, my goodness. Everybody, more watch out. Than heroin. It's, yeah. Jeez, watch that's crazy. Out. Watch out. So, um, <laughs> please be careful. If you're buying, please be careful. Oh, you know. yeah. Get yeah. it from a, you know, a reliable source. Trusted. But this is not a marijuana oh. channel. This is not, it's not a marijuana how you, channel. How do you detect it's a fentanyl? Yeah. Only one way to find out. You smoke it. <laughs> you yeah. smoke it? Yeah. yeah, whatever kids do nowadays. Yeah, whatever the kids do. Well, thank you for the warning. You're welcome. Because for the, you know, the viewers scary. out there. It's scary, really. That is yeah. scary. Pain, is yeah, scary. those painkiller epidemic, that, that thing scary. is really getting there. It's, it's yeah. coming up again. That is scary. Yeah, yeah. You ever see the movie Panic in Needle Park? I am with uh, I Al Pacino. It was his first movie. 
Wow, the movie first the movie. movie. Absolutely brilliant. Back in, uh, here in New York, back where the heroin was. Oh, oh my wow. gosh. Great film. Recommended. Recommended. Very good. Yes. Panic and Needle Park. Panic and Needle Park. Thrill is not gone. Thrill is not still gone. here. Thrill never so we got the thrill. <clears throat> it's gone. It's gone. Now the next. In parentheses. Not gone. Not gone. Not gone. Not gone. And the next one we got. All right, <laughs> there is, there is a slow boat that is going to China. That it is. And you slow boat to China. Yeah. Another cover. Another, another cover. cover. It's another cover. Who? who another who, cover from another artist. Another, Who's the artist? Another mother. Um, uh, I don't know the. I can't remember the original uh, composer. Um, but I know I can't remember this uh, one guy who does it nowadays. He's, he's doing great. But it, doing great. He does a lot of jazz songs. Yeah. Wow. And you know, I just love that song. Yeah. Why not? Throw it in there. Well, yeah, wasn't, wasn't, from what I've heard, you know, in uh, other interviews and speaking with other people, because I, I researching a little bit, uh, um, from what I Google and all that stuff, all that good stuff. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but you you heard "Slow Boat to China" and you love that song, but you wanted a version of your own. And that's you're looking the all thing. over it. <clears throat> that's the like thing. That. Because I remember, um, you know, I was looking all over for this specific sound uh, that I yeah. wanted. Yeah. It's like I've been doing the same thing with Honeysuckle Rose, but I'm not capable of fulfilling that. Uh, you know, I'm not capable of making. You get what I'm trying to say. Oh, yeah, yeah. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No brain fart. Anyway, brain, uh, brain, brain. He's a brain human fart. being. I am. Got the brain So, parts. you know. <laughs> we all get him. Uh, you know, but I, I, I just, I was looking for a version of that. And uh, I was like, well, yeah. I couldn't find it. So I'm like, well, then I'll make it myself. Make it yourself. Oh, and I did. Gave your own just that, that song. Rendition. rendition. It's a good song. Yeah, Absolutely. yeah. Absolutely. Loved your rendition of it as well. Well, thank you. Yeah, it's, it's good. got the Giuseppe flavor all over. Got the flavor all over. You know, I didn't even know it was a cover until you, you told didn't me. Said it. Until you told really? me. Yeah. Until you told me. Yeah. Everything's gotta have that Giuseppe twist to it. Have oh, a little absolutely. twist. Hello. Absolutely. All right. So the next one, the guy from Transylvania. Transylvania. Interesting. Story. Tell me about this, sir. I will tell you all about this song, sir. I remember I was working with this guy from the name Madison Aquino. Madison Aquino. And he was, uh, he had uh, feelings for this one woman of whom I was uh, acquainted with. Uh, of course. And um, I remember I overheard her talking about how she had a boyfriend from. Uh, Pennsylvania. 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 I heard Transylvania. Oh. So later that day, we're walking down the street. I think we were going to, uh, we were doing a CBS run. Of course. That's As one of yeah. us. Yeah. Absolutely. And uh, let me tell you something. He's telling me about this crush he has on her, and I'm telling him, oh, you can't date her, man. You, you, he, She's dating a guy from Transylvania. Oh, he, <laughs> what a me story. Are going, me, him and me are going, what the hell? How the hell did she meet somebody from Transylvania? Lucky you know what I'm saying? So, next thing you know, we go back to the place and we took the song Girl from Ipanema and then wrote a parody uh, guy from Transylvania. There we and, go. Uh, yeah, it's just, you know, I, I, it's just, I think it's a clever song. Yeah, it was, was pretty I never clever. gave him credit, but he helped me with the lyrics to that oh, song. Oh, yes. Shout out to you, Addy Sonic, you know. Addison Aquino. Good boy, good boy. Good man. Good, good guy, boy, yeah. He good is guy. a good guy. Good guy. Did he end up with that girl? I don't know. Ah, I haven't seen him since then. Ah, well, now, one that I find one of my favorites, just because I think it's like so fun, is What a Confusing World. What a Confusing World. Yeah, it is, uh, isn't it? Definitely inspired by uh, the, the lyric from Somewhere Over the Rainbow. A very, very interesting sort of take on, you know, um, how you see the world. Which is I think you're, you're excellent. Whoops! Sorry. There we go. 
But yeah. yeah. Very cool. No, that see, I, I don't have much experience with the ukulele, but one evening I was fiddling around with it, and I knew a few chords on there, so I thought I'd... Why not? Right. Together. Yeah. That's another parrot, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. No, it's an original. Oh. oh. That's an original right there. Yeah. There's a little, like, a little bit of... Um... What a wonderful world, but it's what a confusing world. Yeah, so and it goes so in my own There's a little nod way. to it. There's like this cool. little kind of like, oh, what is this? Oh, and then it's back yeah, to you. Yeah, it's back to you. Yeah, oh, it's back shit. to me. Back yeah. to the Giuseppe. Yeah. Yeah. What, what inspired you to write that song? Yeah. Oh my God, you know. What's going on? What's going on? What's happening? I mean, it's such a confusing world. I mean, if we look at that, I don't mean to get political, but hey, let's get political. Here we go. We're not at a bar. The, 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 you know, the, what's going on in this, in this country? Not only this country but this world i mean look at this we got we got climate change we've got oh. this we've got this we've got that you know and everybody has so much uh thrust upon them we got so many duties we got to fulfill and you know what to do when you become overwhelmed and this yeah. thing but what really inspired that song for me was not that this is kind of a bullshit, pretentious. This is why I wrote that. Yeah, song. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, not yeah. it. I was. This is the heart. Yeah. Back uh, when I was working close with BB, I'm like, right, I was on a first name basis with the man, Mr. King. Man. Uh, he, uh, we were in Vegas. Oh. I remember this, and uh, you know, you know how they, uh, in a lot of the casinos, they, they put a little something, something. In your drink, uh, drinks that makes make you, you want to, you, they, they, yeah, you, you know, they get more money from you. More get money. the claws. You know, it's like, yeah. what's that one movie? There's this one movie where these people are at a casino and they have these lotus flowers and then they're gambling for like four nights. I feel like I've heard of that. I, I can't remember. I think oh, it wait. might have been personal. Oh yeah, my like, god, it is! Percy Jackson! Jackson. The, 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 yeah, what, yeah. Thief? yeah, that was a... That yeah, was a yeah. I remember that movie. That yeah. was before the birth of Christ. That yeah. came out. <laughs> Jesus H. Yeah. B.C. Really e. Beverly before, <laughs> before the birth. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, but, you know. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Way back. Way so, back. So, you know. Uh, I, I ordered something. I just ordered myself a gin and tonic. Yeah. Oh, it was not just a gin and oh. Next thing you know, I, I, I lost my glasses. Supposedly oh. somebody stole them. Oh my So gosh. I'm sitting here, I can't find my glasses, I'm a little blind here. Blind. And I don't know what I mean, if I'm hitting jackpots or not, and I'm, I'm constantly just going and going. I was so broke after that night. Oh, I didn't man. know what was in my drink. If it was the marijuana, the blessed ayahuasca, blessed I couldn't ayahuasca. find my glasses. I did it. So I, I got sat down with the ukulele one day and I wrote about that day. Yeah. Uh, you know, that was a hell of an experience. I was so goddamn broke after that. All my money in one goddamn machine. It's Man. insane. Uh, you know, Vegas. gambling is, is addictive. Well, it happens in Vegas stays, stays in, in Vegas. Vegas. So, what a confusing world. <laughs> the next one is I think inspired by uh by your manager Skydiving. Skyler Moore. Skyler Moore. Skydiving. See, yeah, he founded the uh, Skyler Moore Theater. Yeah, he did that man. He really did. That 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 theater has uh is kind of died out. That theater isn't used anymore. Right, 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 right. right. So Giuseppe is back in the common room theater when he performs rarely. But, yeah, you know. Oh uh, yeah, I wrote that song just to kind of make fun of my manager. Uh, oh yeah, Skyler Moore. Yeah, he's the one who would jump out of a plane forgetting the one thing he needed—a parachute. That's uh, Skyler. That's that's Skyler Moore. Well, but Skyler I love him. Man man. He's a great manager, love him. great man, the most useful manager out of the four I have. Oh, you know, I Shots. I am half tempted to fire all three of them and just get Skyler because he's the only one that gives me advice. The other two just tell me to post this one song up, and the other one just tells me I want you to write this song like this uh, and this song like this. I'm not saying Miss Flanksteak. I'm not saying that, hey, your recommendations are very good, okay? I'm just giving you shit. Oh, yeah. But, you know. Oh, yeah. 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 Hey, you know, you got to tell them sometimes. You sometimes know, you, you got to give them shit. Their day. And sometimes, you know, keep them sh give them shit. Keep, keep them in them. line. Yeah. Yeah, give them a little shit. Like some, some shit to eat. That's right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Next one. Some fertilizer. Some fertilizer. Yeah. You know, that'll put them in their place. Make them bloom. Make them bloom. Make them bloom. And we are talking about... 
a fellow friend, and song, Addison. Addison. So, let me tell you about this song here. It's a parody. It's a parody, and it's, uh... From you know you know the jazz song All of Me. It's a classic uh, song. Mm. Uh, all of me. Why not take all, all of me? me? Yeah. Uh, you know I was sitting in a little uh, jazz club one day. I was doing a little something. Yeah. And you know they always like make the the musicians up there. They always make these little twists on the song yeah. names. Of course. So of we course. I, I somebody called All of Me. So then he's like, All right, guys, we're gonna play Some of Me. I'm like, Oh, yeah. that's yeah. funny. Oh, yeah. shit. Uh, and then the girl from Ipanema, he's like, all right, guys, you ready to play Girl with Emphysema? Uh, uh, he's funny, guys. Funny guy. Funny, funny guy. guy. But anyway, yes. Hey, yes. Yeah, it's about, uh, well, it's actually, he was still going for the same woman. Uh, and, uh, is he still this going woman for is God. I, I don't know. Huh. <laughs> I don't know. God, but, yeah, this down. was decade, this was a while ago. Yeah. And, uh, you know, and, and so we, I, I made a parody. And we were actually, uh, I was thinking of releasing an EP, Addison's Failed Love Life. Oh, but, my goodness, <laughs> but that I was like, a, no, 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 no. That would be a Not my debut one. right there. Yeah. But wow. Yeah. Addison. Beautiful. I'm trying to convince her, you know? Yeah. Why you Come on. Addison, Why don't you take Addison? He'll be your medicine. Be your medicine. I mean, maybe he is an attorney. Maybe you that, that, that could be. You, you can't force something down. You can't force any Addison, Addison no, 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 you know. But you can know. always ask. Always ask. Why not? All right, the next one. We are talking about is Strangers yeah. in the no, Night. No. Cover. Cover. Frank Sinatra. Ah, uh, that's the first version. I've heard it. I heard it. Yeah. Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra. Talk to me about him. What's going yeah. on? Oh. You know what? I saw this uh, video the other day. Have you ever heard of Victor Borg? Victor Borg. No. He was this old comedian and he did, uh, you know, he did. Uh, this thing called phonetic punctuation. Huh. Ah. So, period, or for those of you from the UK, full stop. Ah! Mm. Uh huh. Exclamation mark. You know, the question mark is a hard one. Uh. Oh. Comma is a. Semicolon is a. Colon is a. Quote is a. Or if you're right handed. Oh. Uh, very good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So he, what he did is he was on the air with, 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 with uh, Mr. Sinatra. Yeah. And so he got Frank Sinatra to start singing, and he just throw the punctuation in there. Incredible. Oh. Absolutely brilliant. It was wow. funny as hell. He was just like, fly me to the moon, and let me play oh. among the stars. <laughs> Wow, that's, that's funny. Fun. I'll have to look that up. That yeah. is pretty Look cool. up phonetic punctuation. It's funny as hell. Wow, that is dope. But, uh, that yeah. is very Love interesting. It, In other words, what would Please be true. In other words, I love you. Wow. You know what I'm Beautiful. saying? Very Are you cool. right handed or left handed? Left handed. Left handed. I haven't Incredible. had a lot of those. Well, guess what? He is oh, too. another <laughs> one! <laughs> this is, <laughs> this is oh. my, this is my right hand. But, oh, you know, my this. This. <clears throat> this is something special. And this. This is my left hand. Oh. <laughs> wow. All right. And the final one. A very hopeful, very positive song. On, on the EP here. Somewhere over the rainbow. Take one. Take one cover. Take one. It was a cover. It was done in one take. One I was day. like, fuck it. I just thought that song was really just, you know, a great way to top the album off. You know, I felt like it was just kind of like this thing where, excuse me, you know, uh, you listen to the whole album, and then, oh, the time went by so fast, where'd it go? Somewhere over the rainbow, you know, it's gone. Oh, but I mean, there's always a rainbow somewhere, you know, and I mean, you can always yeah. find this album anytime. Yeah. anytime. And I just thought it was a nice way to talk about But here's the thing. You also have within that song, what a wonderful world. What a wonderful world. Yeah. And you have that song. You know who why? did that song? You know who some, somebody did a cover of that song? Let me watch. Baby King. B.B. King. Yeah, good. Armstrong, uh, he, he did this. He did this song. B.B. King, he, he, he did, he a, did cover. a cover of it. Yeah. 
Yep. And so yeah. that was another um, you know, shout out to yep. Beebs. The, the Beebs. The Not the J Beebs. No, no, no. The no, B Beebs. No. Oh, no. He's back with Selena Gomez again, man. Yeah. Justin Wow. Beaver. Oh, jeez. What do you have goodness. to say about that? She was my middle school crush, and when I found out that he was with her, I was pissed at her for cheating on uh, me. And they broke up, and I was trying to move in on her again. Next thing you know, not anymore. They're, you know, getting all frisky at his father's wedding. Oh, my God. At the father's wedding? I mean, watch your father get married! Uh, wow, what a weird place yeah. to do that. Yeah, come, come on, on Beebs. That's who should be loved. In yeah. Jamaica. They're in the in Jamaica where God lost his shoes. Uh. I'm not saying Jamaica's a bad place. I've been there. I performed with Bob Marley one time. That was a great oh. experience. Oh! Mm. Rest in peace, oh, Mr. Really. Marley. You know, they actually found undiscovered species of bugs in his hair during his autopsy. Uh, that's so crazy. Jesus, really? What? All right, bugs? talk more about this. Wow! About you that? know what they found? I don't know. I mean, I don't think he uh, really washed his hair that often. Oh, He had dreads. He had some mad yeah. dreads. I mean, you true. can smell them. Some species of bugs. Yeah, what yeah. a special death. What a special discovery. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> that stemmed from his death. Undiscovered bugs. It's kind, of, it's kind of like, even when you die, there's still problems. There's still some going on. Circle of life. Circle of life. But I'd make that into a song, but it's already, you know, all yeah, the yeah, yeah, Oh, yeah. oh, God. Don't get me started. I'm not too crazy about that music. Uh, oh, but, um, <clears throat> so that's the end of the thrill. That, that is, is the end. That is the end of the thrill. But if, to contrast with the song, the thrill isn't gone. So how are you continuing... Oh, the thrill. Rainbow. What are some next products? What's going on? Well, I came out with a single. Aha! Uh -huh. Mark of the Wild. We already talked about this. And uh, that was my last release. So I'm letting that kind of get out there before I release. Meanwhile, I'm working on another EP. Yes. And I have the name I'm unsure of right now. Mm -hmm. But uh, we're going to have some older songs that I wrote a while back that I've revisited. Oh. Uh, you know. Nice. Uh, so, I mean, it's kind of going quick. I got two songs done. I'm working on the third that I'm making now. Uh, we got some different tunings on there, you know, different uh, different sounds. It's nice. a bit of a different sound, uh, you know. And uh, but yeah, I mean, it, 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 one of them, uh, one of the songs, "Irreplaceable," it's called. Mm -hmm. I wrote it before I left to go, left before I left home to go to school. Mm. Oh, and I remember I was writing. Um, I wrote this this one line spoiler for anybody. Right. Um, it goes. Uh, it goes. Uh, how the hell does it go? How does it go? How does it go? That's the question. I keep thinking of waiting on you. Oh. Well, oh, the, end, the memories of home still remain, and when I leave it all behind, it still retains through the troubles of all this world, meeting rising suns as my life unfolds. Wow. And so I wrote that. That was the final verse of the song, and then I forgot about the song. And then I remember I was back, I, I was sitting here the other day, and I, was, I remembered the chord progression. And I looked over the lyrics, and it hit me harder than it did when you wrote it. When, you wrote when I wrote it, because when I wrote it, I was depressed about yeah. having to leave, and now I've already taken that step, yeah, You've taken yeah, that leap, yeah. and now I look and I'm like, I'm deterred. Whoa! Yeah. yeah, you know. So that song really hits home. That yeah. that song hits a nerve for me. It's just oh. a personal song of mine. But I think that's one of the most like this is you know my most personal. Wow. So Giuseppe Verdi won't release. Wow. Really? That's it has really released. Very interesting. A very personal song. I love to see a vulnerable yeah. song. Because I think that's what I like about Waiting on You. Because yeah. I think it yeah, really yeah. gets, it touches that vulnerable yeah. side. Oh, this uh, is vulnerable. There's no, there's no jokes in that one. It's oh, a very, yeah. oh. like, very Yeah, not, not many of my songs I have in that many jokes. Yeah, very stripped down to seven. That's okay. Oh, that's, that's fine. Good. That's okay. Fine. There's a time yeah. for everything. Exactly. Not to quote 
Ecclesiastes, but to keep that philosophy alive, there is a time for everything. But, yeah, that song's over. What name did you uh, mention just now? Ecclesiastes. It's a book in the Bible. Ah. Yeah. Mm. Uh. I said not to quote it, though, just to keep that philosophy alive. There is a time for everything. There is. Yeah. Yeah. Very but, nice. Very nice. Are you mocking me? No. No. Oh. No. Oh, Giuseppe. Hey Giuseppe. No. Hey ah, ah. Oh. 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 Please, 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 Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, what the 